So today we are going to look at the Fairline 36 sedan. Just coming to our Brundle office, currently on display in the water here in Brundle. It's a 1989 boat, got twin Volvo TAMD 61s in here. Diesels, through shafts, so plenty of performance there. Just being serviced, anti-fouled, machine polished. It presents well on the exterior. Just have a look at the hole there. You can see the fresh line of anti-foul. Fully enclosed decks there. Nice wide decks. Windless anchor. The flybridge model. Well spec this one as well. We'll have a little bit more of a look into that when we get aboard, but we've got bow thruster generator, warm air heating. So good specification. Kept on the broads in its current ownership, I believe in the current ownership for four years. Yeah, kept on the broads fairly locally. They even platform on the back. Davits there as well. Borden ladder, fender baskets, Katie Joe. Just head round and have a look at the aft cockpit. A good size aft cockpit. Um, original upholstery there by the looks of it. Just starting to show its age in places. Canopy looks to be in reasonable order, certainly serviceable. Flybridge access, and the big sliding patio doors. With a nice open feel to the boat. Good access either side, step on down, port and starboard. Just see that upholstery there, so very original. We'll head on in and take a look around the interior. So just moving on into the interior. Looks like we've had some new upholstery maybe at some point. Certainly looks very fresh, very good order. Got the nice light wood in here. Very light open feel. Headlinings look good. And the uh, woodwork up here also looks in, in, in reasonably good condition. Just pan around so you can see what's going on. We've got the interior helm. Got the chart plotter up there, Hummingbird Helix chart plotter. As mentioned, we've got the bow thruster, so twin shaft. Bow thruster, nice and easy to control. Very maneuverable. As mentioned, we've got the Wabasto warm air heating. That's the uh, Wabasto air top system in here. Patio doors out to the cockpit. And we've got a couple of steps from the main saloon area down into the galley. Lining's just away a little bit up there on top of the galley as you can see a bit more sort of fade to the woodwork down here but no but by no means horrific it's just a little bit of fade and obviously where it's got the sunlight at some point just on there pan around and show you the galley well appointed we've got three burner hob Oven grill, twin stainless steel sinks, hot and cold supply water, got a large refrigerator there, uh, microwave up top, which is included as well. Plenty of stowage. And as you move forward, corridor, got the main cabin forward. Island double berth, 
good sized cabin, floor space at the end of the bed. You can get up and around the bed as well. There's proper island double there. Again, we've got this light timber finish. Linings. Good size cabin. Uh, this is the main head switch, it also acts as an ensuite for the, the forward berth. Got Jack and Jill style door system, so we've got toilet, wash basin, wet room style. Just pan around again on that forward cabin. Drawers under the bed, stowage. There's also, also the uh, second cabin on the starboard side, currently being used as uh, storage. But you can see what's going on in here. We've got twin single berths, hanging lockers, stowage, getting that light to the finish. Good size cabin. Twin berths. We'll take a look up on the flybridge. So just up on the flybridge, good vantage point up here. Got a double helm position. Again, very original on the upholstery. There is cushions down below as well for here, stowed away at the moment. All very original. I mean, probably get to the point where you might want to consider updating that. Helm position. Just pan round. Seating, L shaped seating there. Also on the radar arch, radar arch you'll see there's a bracket here. Radar arch is actually hinged. So drops that air draft down a bit. Um, ideal if you're sort of navigating further inland, some of the canals maybe on the mainland. Just drops that air draft down a little. Access there, up for the ladder through the aft cockpit. And that is the Fairline 36 sedan. As mentioned, just coming to the Brundle office, full specification, photographs in the link below. Any more questions or queries, give the guys at the Brundle office a shout.